Jennifer Lopez has detailed her past abusive relationships which saw her hit rock bottom in her emotional new documentary, The Greatest Love Story Never Told. The singer, 54, who was married to Ben Affleck, 51, said, There were people in my life who said I loved you and then didn't do things that were kind of in line with the word love. You have to hit rock bottom where you're in situations so uncomfortable and so painful that you finally go, I don't want this anymore. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about your favorite global icons. The star, who did not identify who had been abusive to her in the past, said she felt like she was looking through fog as she attempted to get out of the rough situation. The turning point came when a therapist asked her how she'd treat an abusive situation that were happening to her daughter with the star saying, it was so clear. I'd tell her get the fuck out of here and never look back, but for me, it was so clouded and complicated. She said, being thrown around and manhandled like that is not fun. I mean, I was never in a relationship where I got beat up, thank God, but I've definitely been manhandled and a couple of other unsavory things. Rough. Disrespectful. Being thrown around and manhandled like that is not fun. I mean, I was never in a relationship where I got beat up, thank God, but I've definitely been manhandled and a couple of other unsavory things. Rough. Disrespectful. Jennifer shares twins Max and M, 16, with ex-husband Mark Anthony. She has previously been married to Ojini Noah and Chris Judd. The star has been in high-profile past romances with Diddy, Alex Rodriguez, and Casper Smart. JLo also revealed that Affleck was reluctant to appear in her documentary as she attended a recent screening at the Pacific Design Center in Los Angeles, per People. The star said it was very scary to film the candid documentary, saying the other scary part was that I was bringing into it my husband, who was kind of the reluctant participant, silent participant and all. I just said to him during one of the parts of the movie, I was like, is this weird? He's like, yes. I said, you're crazy. I told him he was crazy, not me. But I know that I'm a crazy one. I get that part. But I really feel like as an artist, you have to be vulnerable. You have to, even when you're playing a role, have to get down to the real parts of yourself to share what it's like to be human. And that is a scary thing to do. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like this video and drop comments. And most importantly, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything.